Virginia Task Force 2 is on its way to South Florida to help with search and rescue efforts following last week's deadly condo collapse. More than a dozen people are dead and more than 100 are still missing. Tenant Nearside's John Dowding talked to the team about their mission before they headed out. The specialized team of local first responders answered the call to help search and rescue efforts in Florida this morning and are no stranger to helping communities in need. We're not giving up that hope yet. A team of over 80 local first responders with Virginia Task Force 2 geared up and boarded buses for Surfside, Florida nearly a week after a devastating condo collapse. This is actually what the team was formulated for in the very beginning in 92. So uh, we, we do extensive training with it. It is a low frequency, uh, high danger uh, type, of, type of situation for us. Tractor trailer after tractor trailer left the training facility in Virginia Beach Wednesday. The task force sent down three engineers Sunday to help on scene. Our mission in Florida is going to be whatever is asked of us as a federal resource to assist the state assets working on the ground there, the local and state assets. Whatever our assignment is, this team can handle it. Their first shift begins Thursday at noon. Crews work in 12-hour shifts, working for 45 minutes with 15-minute breaks. Task Force members say they're going down there with the full belief they can still save someone. That's why these things were formed, is, is to, to serve and to protect our fellow citizens. And uh, these people in Miami deserve everything that we can, we can put towards it to try to save a life. The team is expected to be there for at least seven to ten days, and that time could be extended if more help is needed on the ground there. In Virginia Beach, John Dowding, 10 on your side.